welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. I'm more than happy to have you. My name is Reese and today I'm going to be doing a review for you guys on this hair that I have in my head. So, a company called Ali Pearl on AliExpress reached out to me and they were kind enough to send me some hair to review for them. So I received three bundles and one frontal of their straight hair. I'm not sure like if it's Brazilian, Peruvian or what, but I will be sure to link the exact hair down below so that if you're interested, you can go ahead and check out the hair. I got the lengths 18 inch, 16 inch, 14 inch, as well as a 14 inch frontal. So right off the bat, this hair is super, super soft. It's just a natural brown color. Um, and when I opened the box, it came with a cute little baggie. It came with a little hair tie and some lashes. And it came with a pamphlet with a whole bunch of information just on their company and their social media and how you can get in contact with them. And then it came with the frontal and the bundles, of course. The lace on the frontal is super, super soft, so that is definitely a plus. No one likes hard lace on their head. Um, and also what I noticed about the frontal is that it looks very natural. Some frontals and lace front wigs come super unnatural looking with just like a curve on top or you know along the hairline it's just a straight curve. This one it went in and out kind of like a wave so that was definitely good. And also I'll show you here that um, the frontal was very um, I don't know what the word is, not thin, but the hairline wasn't thick, like it faded in and out like natural hair does. It wasn't just super, super full, um, and it wasn't super dense, so that was definitely a good thing as well. And I bleached the knots on the frontal just so that I could give it a more natural look. I did not uh, tint the lace or anything like that, but after I bleached the knots, I did go ahead and pluck the hairline. And actually what I did was I ended up making a wig with this hair. So this is a wig on my head. This is the wig cap that I used. It's just a net wig cap and it has um, adjustable straps. First I sewed the frontal down and then I went in and sewed in the bundles. So I did the frontal first then the 18 inch, 16 inch and half of the 14 inch bundle. Definitely a nice density. Um, Y'all, this hair is literally so soft and it flows so freaking good. Like, another thing that I noticed about the hair is that the ends are nice and full. It's not super full to where it looks fake, but they don't thin out like a lot of straight hair does. These ends are really nice. I'll definitely insert some clips of the bundle straight out of the box so that you can see the ends of the hair are nice and full. It's not thin, it's not rough, it's just soft and flowy and oh my goodness. So yeah, like I said, I just went ahead and made a wig with this hair and unfortunately it seems like the wig came out a little bit too small but I'm gonna make it work. <laughs> so after I sewed all the hair down, I went in to customize my hairline. Y'all, I tried my best. I know I'm not the best at um, doing lace frontals and all that type of stuff but all I did is oh my lightning's changing oh my gosh all I did was I went in with the tweezers and even though the hairline was nice and it had its dips and grooves in it I took it a step further and I tried to mimic my actual natural hairline oh my gosh the lighting really just went super down but yeah I took it a step further and um, tried to mimic my natural hairline which I have a widow's peak so I just kind of try to tweeze back like that so that it would look more natural and then I did the rest of the hairline because although it was natural like I said in and out um, it was hair right on the front of the hairline so I just kind of pulled some of that hair out so it looked even more faded in and out like natural hairlines do and after that all I did was cut some baby hairs Try to make them look like my natural baby hair and my lightning's back, if you guys can't tell. <laughs> All I did was put some got to be gelled right on my hair. Not in front of my hairline. I put it on my hair this time because I wanted it to look like my hair. I feel like when I pull wigs in front of my hairline, even if it's a little bit, I know other people might not be able to tell, but I can tell like 
your forehead is big girl and it just got little like how <laughs> so this time i put the got to be gel right on my hair and just put the lace down and then i took my old faithful of course murray's edge wax and laid my baby hairs down then i laid it that down for about 10 minutes and this is the final result oh and one more thing that I did is I took my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Chestnut because that's what matches my skin the best. And I just kind of faded in along the hairline so that the lace would look even closer to my skin tone. So that's all I did to get this look. I'm sorry if you see a lump right here. Like, I just braided three braids really quick because as you can see, my lighting is going in and out. So I was trying to hurry up. To film this video so I just have like one braid one back and two on the side so if it's a little lumpy that's why but this hair is honestly so soft my friend just left here we just got done working out and she was like I want to try the wig on or whatever and she's like oh my gosh this hair is so luxurious <laughs> like it just flows and honestly I really really do love this hair so thank you so much to ali pearl for reaching out to me i really really love the hair like i said i'll be sure to link their store down below as well as a link to this exact hair in the front of if you are interested in purchasing it so i want to say thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video or if it was helpful be sure to give it a big thumbs up comment down below if you have any questions be sure to check the description box for more information and I will see you guys next time. So close to 10,000 subscribers. I literally can't believe it. The next goal is definitely 100,000. I'm putting it into the universe. Good vibes only. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Snapchat, dog, on the beach, you looking like a fruit.